right after that. All right. All right. Make some noise for Vic City Soldiers, yo. Yep. Yep. What yep. up, Duncan Showroom? Yeah. Yo. What's going on, everybody? How you guys doing? Doing pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty Thanks. good. Pretty good. Thanks you know. again for coming out. Oh, no worries. Appreciate it. It's an honor, man. Thank yep. you. Thanks no, for having us. You guys are super solid. I want to say uh, thanks to Jasper because when things started falling apart, he started suggesting artists. He was helping me out a little bit. Unfortunately, it didn't work out, but that's all right. Homie was trying to give a hand. I appreciate yeah, no that, worries, man. No worries. Yeah, yeah. That's how it is. You got to, uh, you know, make this culture work. You got to you gotta work together, right? So uh, it's dope. I really appreciate that. Um, I wanted to say big ups on the uh, Island Royalty feature. That was a dope track. Yeah, that was oh, a that dope was a good one. one eh? Yeah, yeah. I, Shout uh, out details. Yeah, yeah. Big up, big up details and all the Island Royalty guys there. Um, so what's what's going on with you guys musically lately? I know you got something cooking. Yes, I do. Yeah, 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 yeah. So is there anything you can tell us about it? I am working on a new project. Nice, nice. I'm I'm trying to figure out the name for it if it's like hip hop to the death, but you know I'm just kind of mixing around with it. But I'm I'm on lockdown with four new beats, so I've been working on those. I just started working on the first one yesterday, which is you know a blessing to get back into it. Yeah, dope, dope. Is there uh, any producer you want to shout out or Samson on the beat? Nice, nice. <laughs> uh, what about VCS? Or do you have any any solo new solo stuff coming out? Um, well, like last time we were here, yep. we talked about Eddie and how yes. he's kind of out of the game right now. And I had half an album finished with him. I've actually just started re-recording everything uh, and going through Capital Wave Entertainment. Um, it's a new local production in Victoria. Dope, dope. Okay. Uh, do you have a name for your for your project? Uh, not yet. No. Not yet. Yeah. To be uh, to be continued on that one. Yeah. <laughs> dope, dope. And actually, we actually. Just started working on some new music too. So. Oh, dope! New VCS shit. Yes. Yeah, yeah, sick, sick, sick. When uh, are you guys gonna do another like full album? Yeah, uh, we're gonna VCS? do another full album. Yeah, yeah, right on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that uh, sorry, the capital. What was it called? Uh, capital Wave Entertainment. Capital Wave Entertainment. Is that where you guys are both recording right now? Sort of. Uh, I went there last Friday. Uh, Kills came with me. Uh, he, this guy was out of town, so. Oh, yeah. Right on, right on. Yeah. And what about you, your solo stuff? Do you record at home, or do you... Uh... Yeah, I usually just start my stuff at home and then take it to the studio, kind of just get a practice run. Yeah, right, yeah. Because, you know, you want to do a really good take in the studio. Yeah. You want to yeah. have the crappy ones at home. That's right, yeah. You want to <laughs> nail it. Yeah, that's right. When you're paying that money, you want to exactly. nail it. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You don't want to waste your hour or anything like that. Because like, yeah. let's do, like, 50 retakes. Yeah. All right, okay. How much time we got left? Oh, damn. Okay, uh, let me book in another hour. Hold on a second. Check my... Okay, I can't afford it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Clock, clock watchers and shit, eh? Yeah, 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 exactly. It's rough. It's hard out there, man. It it's is. Hard it, it's costly when you, will be, when you want to do your thing, you know? It's, it's a blessing when you do get to do your thing, and when it does, when it does come together... Sorry, I'm not speaking English. But when it does come together, and the puzzle does come together, and you see that nice, beautiful picture... I get weird with it, I know. Yeah, right? <laughs> oh, it's all good, man. Preach on. Woo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. So last time you guys came, the homie Abyss interviewed you guys, so I never got to ask you a question. Shout out, Abyss. What up, homie? You just yeah. killed that shit. Yeah. Dude, that was, a, that was a dope set for sure, for sure. Man. What is your guys' favorite hip-hop moment that you've experienced so far? Man, there's actually a lot. Um, yeah, we've opened for so many artists. Talk that shit. Um, personally, I think Onyx was probably one of our best shows ever. Yeah, yeah there was like nearly 400 people in, Almost 500 in, the, it was in the fucking bar there. It was oh, crazy. Man. The, uh, the crowd <laughs> reaction was great. It just, it's one of those, like, when you get on stage and, like, you just vibe and then everybody's vibing with you and you can just feel the energy and it just keeps, makes you want to just keep going. I wanted to make a mosh pit. Yeah, yeah. I want to be like, yeah, and just jump into the crowd. You know what I mean? It's like, let's start crowd surfing and shit like that. But yeah, Onyx was really dope. That's his. That's his favorite one. My favorite dope. one is the very first time we ever stepped on stage. Yeah. Like the very first show we ever did together as a group. That's my favorite part because, you know, it, it's almost been a hundred and something shows that we've done together, like me and this guy. But as a group, 
it was a it was a really good thing. I, dope, I'm dope. getting emotional, but at the same time, like it's that's where the love and passion came from. Is when you first step on the stage and you grab that microphone and you're like, yeah, this yeah. is what it's about. Absolutely. Where was that first show, if you don't mind me asking? The Victoria Event Center. Yeah. yeah. Oh, dope. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. we opened for Mad Child. Oh, it was, sweet. It was all right. Yeah, it was yeah, good. right. On. All ages show, like so, young people. It was, our first time performing as a group, so like we were all really nervous and stuff. And I was really like, excited. It was fun though. Yeah, yeah. As soon as I grabbed the microphone, I was like, "Yeah, yeah." Just beast mode. Yeah. <laughs> just, just go. The, the the switch flipped, eh? Yeah, right. I went from that shy guy to being like, "What's up?" <laughs> from Jeremy to Word Master J. Yeah. yeah, that's right. That's right. So, what are you guys listening to these days? What are you guys bumping? A lot of Guilty Simpson and. Uh, Sean P and all that old school stuff. Yeah, like yeah. That, the old school feel. Yeah. P. P. Uh, yeah, that's dope. I've been listening to just the new Eminem album and like yep. just a lot of local stuff. Yeah, yeah. Uh, listening to the Island Royalty album. Yeah. A lot of good songs on that one. Oh man, it's a banger. Uh, yeah, I really like it. It's I've been, it's been in my steady rotation since it came out. There's been a lot of uh, really, uh, well. There's been quite a few albums dropping lately, actually, uh, with Confidential and oh, yeah. ESQ. That was really dope. Um, and then ESQ dropped that other one, JT Owens. Yeah, that was pretty good. That was pretty good, too. Um, it, it seems like it's a good time, even through COVID, for island hip-hop, uh, in my opinion. It, it, it hasn't seemed to slow down that much, really. No, no not at all. I think the COVID actually um, embraced it, to tell you the truth, just because you're bored. Yeah. You're like, Let, let's do something with all these beats. You know, it's like a vote. You just go with there and you're like, okay, <laughs> let's pick a topic and work on that one today. I think it kind of helped with everybody, like, getting back into focus into making music. Because, yeah. you know, a lot of the artists that are on the island were, like, you know, in rotation with different types of shows, especially down in Victoria. Like, yeah. I host a lot of the events down there. And, like, yeah, no, I guess COVID just kind of helped them step back and, like, just produce their music, right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you gave everybody a lot of time to focus. For real. Like, <laughs> what else could you do? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Nothing. That's right. Skip the dish. That's right. <laughs> uh, is there anybody you guys have been working with lately that you want to give shout outs to? Not just Starcore. I've been bu buying beats off them for like the last few months, just Dope. getting the next albums planned out and everything. Yeah. Shout out to the homie Whisper. We've been doing a Dope. lot of things. Oh, yeah, together. Whisper too. Yeah, we, we got a couple tracks with him yep. that are Dope. in the works. That's yeah. uh, that's Team Bliss, right? Team Bliss. Yeah, absolutely. Shout out those guys. Uh, I've seen them. They're pretty busy as well. Yeah. Busy as well. They put on a couple uh, live stream shows. As, uh, shout out Team Bliss. Uh, shout out Bandits as well. With, oh, yeah, uh, Skinny right Buff. Right yeah. yeah, that's yeah. our boy. Skinny Buff. He's doing it. Trying to keep it alive as well, you know. Uh, so anyway, I'm not going to take up any more of you guys' time. I'm going to let All you guys right. rock out. Right on, brother. Thanks again for coming yeah. through. Thank you for having us. You guys are solid as fuck. So make some noise for Vic City Soldiers, everybody. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah.